Mask on. Mask on. Mask on. Mask on. Mask on. Hi, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. And if you are new, welcome to my channel. And thank you so much for clicking this video. Today, I'm going to be doing my nighttime skincare routine, get ready for bed with me, whatever you want to call it. Um, I'm just going to be getting ready for bed and uh, showing you guys, I guess, the things that I use. I had some people ask me to do a nighttime routine, so that's what I'm going to do. You ask and I deliver and that's, when, that's, that's, that's that. Yeah. Right now, I already took a shower, so I saved my face for y'all, which is weird, but yeah, I took a shower already, so I put on this robe. I call this my get ready with me robe because in my first ever YouTube video, this is the robe that I wore. I got this robe from a Victoria's Secret, and I absolutely love it. Um, I got it on clearance, guys. Get your things on clearance. Why are you afraid of clearance? Okay, why? Please tell me you get some good stuff if you guys want to see what products i'm using and just want to see me get ready for bed uh yeah keep watching okay we're about to um go to bed <laughs> the first thing i do once i get out the shower is moisturize that is super important to me i have to moisturize i don't like to go to bed feeling dry at one point in my life i used to go to bed without putting anything on and i really regret that now because I have a lot of stretch marks and I don't know if that's attributed to my skin not having the right moisture I guess the right amount and I don't know so I just I just make sure I moisturize every single night so I'm gonna do that right now okay so these are like my my go-to's these are like necessary absolutely necessary no doubt about it I have to use these this is for my stretch marks and I actually spoke about these in my morning routine that i did um if you guys want to check that out i will leave the link down below and you guys can go watch that i spoke about these i use these morning and night this one right here is from the body shop it is a vitamin e essence lotion and i use this on all the spots i feel need extra help this is also a palmer's cocoa butter um formula vitamin e so vitamin e is super good so i use that a lot and i use this on my back for extra moisture because i don't I, I find it harder to lotion my back so when I put oil on there it's it lasts longer and I feel very very moisturized with that so yeah okay so I just finished putting all those on I didn't feel like y'all need to see all that because it went to the parts where you know YouTube wouldn't allow me to post and I wouldn't allow myself to post so yeah that was that all right so when I'm going to bed I don't like to put on anything that is strongly scented i want to be like it i want a light scent so for my body moisturizer i'm going to be using this falling in love scent by philosophy it's really really good it's a body butter and um it's not strong at all and i really really love this so that's what i'm going to use all over mint and cream scent on it's a body spritz you pretty much just open it my hands kind of greasy and i just put it on my hand like this and i kind of just like sap it on me you know just put it on here it just is a little extra something a little extra scent that i can have since i don't really spray anything too crazy on so this gives it's like a sweet it feels like like a sweet mint kind of thing it's not too minty but it, it smells really good and this is um philosophy as well okay so the last thing i do regarding getting ready and moisturizing and just finishing off the body stuff i'm gonna use a perfume this one is living grace also a philosophy product love this it's a really light scent and i just spray this on and i, I don't know I like smelling good all the time. I have about two of these little perfumes. They're like $8 and I just buy them and you know, I use them some for the day, some for the night and they're really good. Okay, so now I'm gonna take off my makeup. I'm gonna put my hair up in a bun. And we're gonna get this process started because I feel super greasy and super oily. 
I use this. This really keeps my hair really secure at night. So I'll just flip it like this and wrap it around. Kind of messes up the bun a little bit, but that's okay. So I'm gonna just take off this makeup. Sorry if I'm talking though. My mom's in the other room, so I'm like, okay. I usually use about two to three makeup wipes in order to remove my makeup, but I don't know, how many do you guys use? I just want to make sure it comes all the way off, you know? Okay, I think that's it. I think that's enough. I only use two tonight, so yeah, so all the makeup is off my face, and next thing I'm going to use is my micellar water. This is one that I've been using. This is the Yes 2. It protects and minimizes irritation. My skin gets irritated really, really fast. So, um, this is good. I also use this one too. Now, it's my mom's, but we bought it together kind of thing. But, um, we're just going to use this one tonight. I basically just get a cotton ball and wipe away any excess dirt that's on my face. I'm not going to bed dirty. Not today, not tomorrow, not any day. Even if you do makeup wipes, like there is still like things underneath your skin that you just need to get. Like look, you see? It's there. Face is already getting red, like if you guys can see. I don't know if you guys can really tell, but my face gets red super fast. And I've been breaking out on this side of my face, so I'm really, really trying to take care of my skin. cleanser i'm going to be using today okay i'm going to be using this coconut oil cleansing balm that i use i love it so much you basically put it on put some warm water and then it emulsifies on your face i really really like that i'm a big palmer's fan as you can see so my face I'm like totally ready for bed because I don't know my eyes just start to get blurry and I get tired <laughs> now that my face is washed I'm gonna do a charcoal face mask I usually wouldn't use a charcoal peel off mask I usually do it because I'm breaking out on this side so I'm gonna go heavy duty tonight this mask kind of brush thing with a purchase of two other masks that I have so um yeah I really wanted this I hated doing it with my hands by the way PSA um, you don't need a lot a little bit goes a really 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 long way and make sure you don't get this on your eyebrows or your edges because that's that's a no you don't want it to pull out your hair so and I also want to mention you don't have to put this all over your face you can just put it in the spots where you feel you need a little bit extra work because it's really no point in putting it all over your face but I mean you can but I don't put it all over sometimes I don't I'm just like sometimes this area needs a little work so I'll put it there and that's what I'll do okay so I usually don't put it around here because I don't these aren't this isn't really a problem area for me and it's also a little bit difficult to put it there so I just kind of leave it like this and I'm gonna let it dry it takes about 20 to 30 minutes depending on how thick you applied the layers so I didn't do it too thick this time but me I overdo everything so in the next 20 30 minutes I will be back to show you guys how this looks when it's getting taken off and we're gonna moisturize and then we'll be ready for bed it's been about 20 minutes um i just watched some youtube i'm so tired i'm exhausted so i'm gonna take this mask off now mask on mask on mask on mask on 
Okay, so I took the mask off and I'm going to now moisturize my face. Right now, I'm going to be using this Yes to Coconut Hydrate and Restore Facial Moisturizer. It's actually meant for overnight use and I use this pretty much every night on my face and my neck. I don't have an under eye cream or anything like that. I just use this all over my face and this keeps me pretty moisturized so every night i use this mixture i use my coconut oil and my castor oil i mix them and i put them on my eyebrows as you can see they're growing out a lot a lot a lot a lot um the ends of my eyebrows are really really light so you can't see so i want them to grow in super thick this is my rose beauty oil by the beauty foundry um i use this just a little bit i actually don't want to use too much oil on my face at night but this just gives me that extra hydration that i may need so just a little bit okay once i'm done with that i use my evian facial spray and i just put that all over my face and then i'm pretty much done with my face If I could recommend to you guys any facial spray, it would definitely be this one. The way it comes out, the mist itself is everything. I love this. I love this. I love this. And I got it for $7.99 in Marshall. So go get it. I've been using charcoal toothpaste, but for the past few days, I haven't been able to find my charcoal toothpaste. I don't know where it went. So for now, I'm just using regular old Colgate Max Fresh with whitening. And um, that's pretty much what I'm going to do. I wear retainers at night. So I just, I'm going to brush my teeth, put on my retainers. And that's pretty much going to be it for my nighttime routine. I'm just going to put a little bit more of my lip therapy on. Cause it'll stay on all night because i don't really lick my lips at night so i have this hand cream from the body shop it's coconut scented um and i just put a little bit on and <clears throat> i'm gonna put my bandana on and that is pretty much it i'm ready for bed i have everything done i feel super tired after this i usually just read a book or go on my youtube i'll edit do homework whatever i need to do but i haven't read in a little minute now so i'm gonna go read i like to instill positivity um into my life very often let me know what you guys want to see next for me i hope that you guys enjoyed let me know down in the comments what you guys do to get ready and if you guys have any questions make sure you hit me up on my instagram dm me comment down below i try to read all your comments and i'm so grateful for every one of you that support my videos i hope to see you guys in the next video and i love you guys so much